hi guys welcome to my another digital art tutorial in this particular video I'll be painting a hyper realistic portrait so let's get started without wasting any further time draw a sketch on a layer this step is very very easy and very useful for the painting that you will make I am very much impressed by an artist known as Mike Dargas. He makes this hyper realistic portraits so amazing. I thought I should give it a try. Let's see how it goes. And try to make it as real as possible without any tricks and tools. Just a brush. A fresh raw art. And trust me, this is the result I've got without any tricks or tools, just by using a brush, a single brush, that's it. And if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, then please hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get further notifications. I upload 2 to 3 videos each week, so don't miss out on that. And all you will need is Photoshop and a pen tablet. You don't need a fancy one, you just need a simple pen tablet. That works fine. If you're curious to know which one I'm using for this particular painting, I'm using one by Wacom. It's cheap and the best to start with. Now the brush that I am using for this digital painting is a normal brush with a touch of oil painting texture because I love oil paint so smooth and mixing is so much easy with it. You can use the brush you like. Brush isn't a big deal here, but a good brush comes handy. It makes the job a bit easier. And guys, if you don't have a particular brush that you want, comment below, I'll provide you the brush. And as you can see, I do it part by part. I choose a part, for example, the lips. I paint it with the basic colors, then I mix them, and at last, I add the details. Then I move to the next part. That's how I do it, but you can do it your way. You can just put the basic colors on the whole face or the whole painting at once. Then you can mix them, then you can add the details. Either way, first put the basic colors, then mix them, then add the details. That's how it works. So there are 4 easy steps that you will need to paint anything in the world. First of all, make a sketch. Then put the basic colors, 
mix the colors accordingly to the light and the shadow you have to keep in mind where the light is coming from and where the shadows are going to be and at last you can add those tiny details that will make your painting hyper realistic And again guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, then please go and subscribe to my channel. Also click on the bell icon. To make anything look hyper realistic, there's just one thing, the details. And you have to work on it guys, you have to work on it seriously. The more amount of details you'll add to the painting, the more realistic your art will be at the end. On Photoshop, you have a superpower to zoom in and add details. And as we all know, with great power comes great responsibility. So add your details very wisely, not too much, not too less. Because the details is what is going to make your painting look super, super real. And always decrease the size of your brush as much as possible while adding the details. That way you can easily do it more precisely. Keep zooming out and see the whole picture that way you can spot small mistakes out which you didn't see before. And I'll advise you not to use the eraser at all when you make a mistake. Just take the brush, pick the right color and fix it. It's that simple. However, you can use the eraser to make your edges of the painting right. I started painting digitally back in 2014. With each day I'm getting better and better. If your result is not as good as you expected, just don't be sad, don't lose hope. My first painting I remember it was a complete mess. You just have to work hard on your skills, that's all you have to do and eventually you'll get better and better. The only key to perfection here is practice, practice and practice. More you practice, better you will be at it. I promise you. If you are doing it forcefully because you think it's cool and stuff, then you shouldn't do it. You should really do what you love to do. Only if you fall in love with the art, you will make it as an artist. Otherwise, you will be just a guy who tried it for some time and left it.
So guys, please don't be that guy. Work hard on your skills and I know eventually you'll make it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, then please hit the like button, share it with the friends, and again guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, then please go and subscribe to my channel. Also click on the bell icon. I upload 2 to 3 videos each week. Don't miss out on that. Thank you for watching the video guys. I'll take a leave now. Stay artistic. Bye for now.